Here we have the Force 3 treadmill, which uses the Pacer Performance System software and the XPV7 interface. Uh, we're going to run a simple trial with walk, run, sprint commands. You can see he gets his first walk command and tries to keep the green velocity line up to the red target line. Moves into a jog phase, once again trying to match the target range with his current speed. Drops back down to a walk. And then we move into a sprint phase. Once the program has finished running, we can go and have a look at the reports. This will give you detailed information on distance, velocity, power and force in the performance report. And also information on gate parameters such as step rate, step length, horizontal force, vertical force, uh, work and power for each left and right side. It also gives you split times. Uh, you can set the split times to whatever distance you like. In this case we've got them set to 10 metres. Then we can go and have a look at the graphs. You can graph distance. velocity in the velocity we can see the sprint phase of the graph we can zoom in on that by left clicking and dragging and zoom back out by left clicking and moving in the other direction you can show power you can see the relationship between the power and the velocity once again you can zoom in So show horizontal force, vertical force, the target and heart rate if you have a heart rate monitor connected. We can also have a look at the gait of an athlete using a test conducted over a, once the athlete is up to velocity, you hit start, click data for 40 seconds or so and you can have a look at their gait. And to do this, you can view vertical force, horizontal force, step length, step rate. You can zoom in on any portion of the graph we want. You can also view centre of pressure, anterior, posterior, and centre of pressure, medial, lateral. Zoom in on the graph just here. And we can hit report. This is the period of the graph that we've got selected. Hit report, go to report page. In, in the gate parameters, the section that we've zoomed into will now be highlighted in the gate parameters section. So you have the step rate, step length, horizontal first, vertical force, work power for average left and right legs. And you, this is for the period of the graph that you have zoomed into on the gate page. If you go to the graphs, you can have a look at velocity and zoom in on a portion of the velocity. Hit the report button. The performance report will change to the area that you have zoomed into. We'll move back out to the graphs page, zoom into a portion of the graph, hit report, and that will change our report to just that period of the test. See the total distance is only 13.06 metres now, the 
time is only 4.36 seconds. 4.631 seconds. Zoom back out and hit the report button again. Go back and this expands it to the whole test session.